Hello from Canada, Smitty here. This is an LMC, a light meal combat from 2021. Peri Peri Tuna from Canada. I love Peri Peri, I love tuna, and I'm hungry. We're 7K in right now, so I'm interested in seeing what's in it. So like the 2020 IMPs and onward, you've got a tear notch and a resealable Ziploc. Inside, I've got tortillas. Nescafe Sweet and Creamy. The vanilla drink mix, which unfortunately has changed. Maltodextrin is now the number one ingredient, so that's great. I haven't seen this one before. This is a Travelers mix. That's kind of neat. I have no clue what that is. I hope it's got jerky or something in it, but I doubt it. Here's a Peri Peri tuna. This is just a straight up commercial pack, right? So that's got to be good. Not too much in there. 170 calories, but man, that protein, that's going to help. I love this product. Chocolate's not my favorite, but this is still an excellent freaking protein bar. The macros aren't amazing, but man, is this tasty. The chocolate's a little thirst provoking, but uh, the vanilla is my favorite. I'm still gonna love this. I'm still gonna eat this. This is, this is great. So we've got two fruit punch sports drinks. Eh. And then you can also put them inside the beverage bag with to gusset. Then to round it out, you've got your spork. And you've got your compressed towelette. Don't eat that, that's not a mint. Although, it does look tasty. The forbidden mint. So all in all, all of these ingredients comes out to 1,350 calories. Not too bad for a light meal. These are excellent, delicious. Best before date of 2022, but pretty awesome. And the whole LMC pack has like, I think, 50, 50 plus grams of protein in it. So not too bad. They're lightweight, they're simple, they're delicious. Traveler's Mix is not too bad. You know, it's flavored pretty decently with a little bit of soya sauce. You got that delicious crunch. You got the rice puffs, the, the pretzels, the whole works. Not a bad little mix. As for the Peri Peri, that's a Portuguese uh, pepper. They make a pepper sauce, Peri Peri sauce, of course. If you've ever eaten at Nando's, you've had it. A little spicy. It's really good though. Anyone that does not like spice is not going to like this stuff, but but it's excellent. 15 grams of protein in this bad boy. Yeah, this hits the spot. I would love this. And if you threw it on the tortilla, I I think that's also a win. But I'm not a big tortilla guy for uh, for walking around eating a little tuna taco. Well, instead of eating this on the go, I decided I'd just take this back home and open her up. Here's the vanilla drink mix. You just add the water to the fill line, and then you give her a pretty good shake. It doesn't mix up very good, and it's got really grainy texture, not a great flavor, heavy on the maltodextrin taste to it. Not great anymore. Here are the drink mixes. This stuff is all right, not my favorite, but again, mixes up nice and quick, and it's a delicious little beverage if you gotta have it so oh well of course my hero coffee the three-in-one coffee i'd rather drink black coffee but again it'll hit the spot nice and creamy nice and sweet the tortillas themselves are a u.s product they're very familiar for anyone with an mre or imp background they're okay but they do kind of get a little bit weak so you got to kind of watch it if you fold it too much they'll come apart no problem and they're all right well, I really enjoyed that experience. I think the uh, peri peri chicken is super awesome. You know, it's spicier than most things in, in military rations. Uh, not a lot of it. Can't spread that over two tortillas very efficiently. And it is missing like a cheese spread or something. That'd be pretty freaking awesome. But uh, all in all, I am happy with it. You know, it's a great product. It's light. It kind of breaks up the monotony of uh, the IMPs. You know, military rations, when it comes down to it, are... Uh, very susceptible to menu fatigue. And recently with the IMPs not switching anything up, it's become kind of exacerbated there. So it's nice to see, and uh, I really enjoyed it. You know, now they just need to bring back that shredded cheese one and then we'd really be talking.